And it all starts with this. The so-called Tristan Chord. It may not look revolutionary, but it must have astonished the first audiences who heard it. Rather than progressing to a harmonious resolution, as musical convention expected, it evolves into another unresolved discord instead. I've come to the house where Wagner once lived to explore that cluster of notes which opened the door to modern music. Wagner's piano, this was given to him, I can see, is it? This is a pretty good piano, a gift from the Steinway factory to Richard Wagner in 1876. Oh, uh, to celebrate the beginning of the... beginning the of the festival? festival. Yeah. And would you let me just try and play the... Um, of course. ...the famous chord. I'm just... I'm not going to do any more than that, but this chord here, I want you to explain why it's... I, I, yes. It's the first chord of yes, Tristan yes, in the prelude, but... Yes. I'm playing the Tristan chord on Wagner's own piano. Yeah. I have to pinch myself to see that <laughs> I'm not dreaming. Yes, very important. There it is. The famous yeah. Justin Court. Welcome with the other and two then notes. You so get this. Oh, that's it. They're there on the, the E and the A flat. That's it. Yes. Ah, uh, this chord. If someone was to look it up on Wikipedia, they'd find a huge entry just on this chord. Mm. What is it about this chord? It's a chord of tension, of longing. Yeah. The first voice goes up. Like you played, yes, right? That, that longing, And the yeah. other voices go down. So this is a depression. Yeah. And this at the same time. Yes. This is where Wagner's genius as a yes. composer merges with his brilliance as a dramatist. His music keeps you on the edge of your seat, longing for the unbearable tension of those opening chords to be resolved. Yes. It almost happens in Act Two, when the lovers meet in secret to consummate their passion. Yeah, it sounds vulgar, but it really is a coitus interruptus in the, yes. the Liebes Nacht, the great duet, where it, you think it's yes. going to arrive then, don't you? Yes. And then in comes... It's very erotic music. In comes, yeah. Rette dich Tristan happens. It's, yeah. uh, and and it's, it's, a, it's as if people have dis, are literally in bed with each other and they are actually making love, and just as the climax is about to arrive, bang, someone comes in and... and... Interrupted. Yeah. It's fantastic. Interrupted. It's such a moment, isn't it? Yes. It's now I show dance. you the non-interruption, the transformation. Yeah. Finally, after four hours of the most glorious, gut-wrenching music, the psychological drama launched by that famous opening chord reaches its tragic climax. Loose, 
Now for the last time, the longing motif comes back. Chromatic scale going upwards. Leading Finding that E is gonna come trend off to, to the transition e. to transcendence. It's not so easy. It's not. The piano playing. I get, no, I get <laughs> over excited. Uh, but my goodness, to have been even a small part of it. Yes, <laughs> you've made me the happiest man in Germany today. There's <laughs> nothing to say. No, there is nothing to say. That's it's, exactly uh, the point. Extremely good music. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>